Hello and welcome to today's daily vlog. Um, Molly is down here. She's just been eating her chew. Um, I've got to nip to the shop quickly. Mum wants a few bits. She wants coffee. And there's one other thing that she wanted as well. So I need to go and get her those bits. A bit cloudy outside but not rain clouds it's just clouds are quite high in the sky not much wind but probably a bit of a breeze um so anyway let's go to the shop um get these few bits um i want to go and go through the photos that i said about yesterday go through them so you try and get to, just to let you get to know me, me a bit better with these vlogs um, and yeah let's go <sighs> okay so we're gonna go to the shop and take Molly for a walk she's just in the back there you right Mom? <laughs> so yeah I'm gonna go for a walk um, I need to get a few bits on the shop today so we shouldn't be that long at the shop and it's not that late I don't think half two so yeah I'll go to the shop get the coffee and there's something else I need to get um, and then take my for a quick walk come back and then we'll go through those photos so we've been to the shop just got to the um, dog walk now um, gonna go for the walk and then head home in like a bit I'm just gonna take her for a bit of a walk she's just over the back here <laughs> so we're gonna go for the walk and now getting on a bit it's now coming up to half three so I'm gonna take her for a quick walk um, and then go back on to try and get those I'm trying to show those photos like I said yesterday. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go for the walk and go home. So we'll see you at home. And we're now home. So yeah, I've been home a while. I took Molly in the garden because she um, likes to go in the garden when we first get back to the house. Um, I've got a green juice. I haven't had a green juice for quite a while, so um, I thought I'd just pick one up. I actually got four, so one for today and one for the next three days. Um, so what I'm going to do now is go through these photos so you can get to know me a little bit better in this video. Or should I say this vlog. Uh, I'm just going to put you guys down here. Lift you up a bit to strain you out and then take you back there. Okay, so <clears throat> this picture here, actually, this one just here. This is a yacht that I used to live on. I lived on that for um, three years um, with my dad, his best friend. And his best friend's girlfriend we all lived on that it was a yacht called the valiant lady and um yeah we lived in spain for three years i actually got to experience the spanish education system for the last year and a half that i was out there so yeah it was quite a fun experience had um i basically got taken out of school and go to live there. i was homeschooled for quite a bit of the um, time that we were out there and um, yeah that was basically my home for three days anyway let me get this box open um, we might see some more pictures of the yacht from like inside here as we go through this but um, yeah um, this here was, um, was in 1990 
we all um, we all did this charity single with um, Jive Bunny, and we got all we hired all these buses, and um, there was loads of us all went to make this um, this song with Jive Bunny for this um, charity. It was um, Telecom ninety. Um, this here was when we first moved to Spain. We lived in my grandma's villa, and my grandma had a villa out there. And this was like a castle on top of the mountain on the inside. One day, we um, climbed up the mountain, went into the um, like it was like a ruined castle at the top. And you can sort of like look around it, and this was basically the castle at the top of the mountain when we first moved to Spain. Um, this was in Spain, this was like at a fisherman's barbecue on the beach, this here, this, this here, that was Andy, my dad's best mate at the time. And um, you know, all these here were like the fishermen that were um, having a barbecue on the um, beach. You might be able to see that Andy just here has like um, charcoal on his cheek. The fisherman, he got charcoal on the fingers and they'd go around and catch you and push it on your cheek. <laughs> this is me and my dad up the mountain in Spain. Um, when we were living out there, we used to go on bike rides up the mountains. I think this is where we've actually st stayed quite a lot. It was like the area where I went to school. Uh, <laughs> this is me on the boat in the bedroom. Yeah, it was a very small sort of like room. You didn't really get much space on the yacht. Um, this was me up the mountain in Spain on a day trip out in the mountain um, somewhere near the um, castle um, that's another one of up at the castle it's me and my grandma in the um, castle area. This was the garden at my, one of my old houses. It was quite a small garden, that's one of them. That was in, I used to do horticulture at college, so this was like a thing that I did for a course. That was me when I was younger, doing the garden. Another one of me. <laughs> Another one. That's the actual from the other side of the garden. It's a very small garden, this house. <laughs> that was my old bike. I think that was before we actually made the garden. It was all grass at one point and we put gravel down. This was at a scout camp we actually made this bridge across this river out of like the wood and then um, just rope. You had to tie um, tie it and actually make, make the bridge across the river. Um, that was at a karate competition I went to watch, I wasn't actually in it. This here was like the marina where um, we stayed the most on the boat with the yacht. We actually, the boat was over here somewhere. And this was like the area it was like here was like the building where you had to go and pay for your war in. This is one time when we had the yacht out the water, my dad um cleaning in the bottom and repainting 
repainting it. That's me when I was really young. <laughs> On the phone with my grandma. Um, that's my dad inside the yacht. Um, that was like near the kitchen area on the boat and then as you can see just um, here this was like the entrance to the inside you went up these sort of like steps and like a thing you went through here and then this white bit just here that was like the mast it went right went right through the boat the mast which made it safe because it was like stronger a lot of boats they bolted them at the top on the actual deck this was at my um 13th birthday party in like 1993 yeah we were in 1993 when we had the boat taken out of the water this was like the machine that that did it for you we went on these you had to bring the boat in and then the straps went underneath and then it lifted you out like a crane and then put you onto some like wooden blocks anyway um i'm just gonna quickly change the battery because the battery's flashing and then um i'll be back with the rest okay i'm back um so the last photo was the crane that the um the boat was taken out of the wet water with. Um, so this was a, um, an event called, um, I think it was just called Bike 90 something. Might have been Bike 98. So I was sort of like back from Spain at this point. And I met um, Dave Mirror, the mountain, uh, the BMX rider. Yeah, that was a photo I had with um, Dave Mirror. Um, that was like posters that I had up in my room at the time, all mountain bike and BMX. A lot of these are like muddled up, so they might go back and forth a bit because that's my dad's friend's house in Spain. Um, before we actually moved to Spain, my dad sponsored, um, had his own business and he um, sponsored um, a cycling team and this was like two of his riders at the start line I can't remember the names uh, so this is back this was back on the boat, this was like two dolphins but yeah, this was like two dolphins that um, that we saw. They came and swam next to the boat um, for a bit. I don't know if that's going to focus any better, but yeah, there we go. Uh, that was like two dolphins that came and swam by the boat. Um, from inside the boat. I think this was like around Christmas and my birthday. We've got the um, tinsel up and balloons up there. So yeah, that would have been around the time of Christmas. My birthday is like 22nd of December. That was another castle in Spain. It's, um, I think this was the castle de Almeria. The Almeria Castle. Um, that's another picture from um, one of the other bedrooms on the boat, that's my dad <laughs> that was me at college in one of the greenhouses that's me and my dad on the um, boat again um, yeah I'm sort of like halfway up the gully or rigging sort of then so yeah that was on on the boat this was me my dad and my grandma when i um finished college getting my certificates and and everything um my mum and my dad 
one of my birthdays. This was me when I was into like road cycling. Um, I basically won in my age group. I came second in the entire race. Um, yeah, I used to be really good at really into um, road racing. I was into most most cycling and everything, and that was like um, this like race that I ended up like after school. That picked me up, went straight to the circuit, and then I was in that race. When I was living in Spain, I used to come home and like to visit my mum and everything. And this was like a a farewell party before I was heading back to the um, the boat. And we all planted like a tree in like my like um, remembrance sort of like farewell bon voyage sort of like tree planting thing with. Um, a couple of friends and that this tree was planted in like um the corner the one on that old garden before the garden that I showed you earlier with all the that flower bed this was like another garden that we had um so yeah that was like a, a little garden that's my dad on the boat again that's actually next to the kitchen again this here was a boat no bigger than a bathtub and um, there was a little Chinese guy that um, had this boat and he was, you know, it was just about to um, I want to sail the Atlantic in it over to America all the way from where we were in Spain and it was literally no bigger than a bathtub yeah. it was tiny so yeah, there was that. This is one of my birthdays in Spain. This was like at the table um, on the yacht. So yeah, that was like um, one of my birthdays. I think it was like a, some kind of birthday cake that I'm blowing out there. And yeah, I was on the yacht. And that's another one from when we had the boat. Out the water. I don't know if you can see that. Wish it would focus. So yeah, that was another one. When we had the bow out the water. Um, I think you can see where the white. This side. Um, so we had already painted. Took out the water to um. To paint the underneath and clear the um clear the um the bottom of the boat from like barnacles we actually found um some mussels that were um attached to the bottom of the boat and uh, we took them around all the local fish restaurants and we actually ended up selling them to a fish restaurant i think it's for about 500 pesetas at the time obviously spain's now gone into the euro so and this was like way back before the euro was introduced and yeah back then it was like Spain Spain's currency was pesetas and um, yeah I got 500 pesetas for them um, like a good big shopping bag size so yeah uh, anyway that's all um, that's all the photos that I've got really um, yeah, it's quite a lot. I mean, look at the mess I've got to tidy up now. I'm going through all these photos. And now I've got to go and put them all back in the box. But yeah, um, I think I moved back on Spain in like... 1995 I think it was around Easter time 1995 because um, I was back in the country two days and then I was back in school um, so yeah it was quite an interesting little time going out there um, learned quite a lot 
Um, and I really enjoyed it actually, being out there in Spain and living on a yacht and everything like that. I've seen all the dolphins. Um, yeah, there's a few stories about that that I might um, tell over on my main channel. Was um, I don't see the picture in that lot, but um, I'll try and find it and put them away because um, I try and find this picture when I'm putting all these away but we were actually um had to call a May Day uh, when we was on the yacht and we had to um we ended up getting towed in by the Spanish Navy. Um I'm gonna I'm gonna make it into a make a video for my main channel about it. And um yeah we had to get towed in by the Spanish Navy because there was a bit of a problem with the yacht. And there was some dangerous weather, but yeah, I'm gonna make a video about it for my main channel. So if you want to go see that, I'll let you know when I've made the video on my main channel, and I'll send you over there when it's done. But yeah, I'm gonna put all these pictures away and um, go on YouTube for a bit. Hope you enjoyed this little segment of me showing you these pictures. I um, yeah, I haven't really mentioned anything about my life in Spain since I started YouTube like back in 2011 or whatever it was when I started um, but yeah I used to live on a yacht in Spain for three years um, but yeah I'm gonna go watch some YouTube now mine's actually lying right by my feet he's like down here <laughs> So yeah, I'm gonna put the pictures away, and um, that picture that I showed you at the start of the um, the buses where we went to do the sea, the um, single with Jai Bunny, I'll put that um, I'll put that the song, a link to the song, um, in the description. So if you want to go and um, hear the song we did in 1990 with Jive Bunny um, I'll put that in the description so you can go to the link and um, hear the song um, but yeah I'm going to put the, clear all this away back into the box and then watch YouTube for a bit and then go do dinner so it's just it's now 5.40 I'm running a bit late, I'm going to do dinner. We're either going to have um, sirloin steaks with um, veg or chicken with chips. Um, so yeah, I'm going to see what I'm going to have, get it cooked, get it eaten. Um, Molly, I'm pretty sure, wants her dinner. So I'm going to do all the dinners and then come back up and watch some YouTube I haven't watched any YouTube yet because I've literally put the photos away and all my desk is now clear I don't need to sort this bit out I just dumped all that there but yeah um, I'm going to do dinner then and then come and watch a bit of YouTube I've actually got a bit tired um, now, yeah, I had dinners, and then YouTube. Well, so I just had dinner, um, we had like a spicy chicken, I thought like really spicy, it was like a chilli chicken, sort of like breast, and like this chilli marinade. Um, had that with some chips and peas, and it was really good. Molly's over there by the door tonight. You alright, Mom? Anyway, I'm going to watch some YouTube now, and then, um, I don't know what I'm going to do after that. Uh, I'm going to watch some YouTube now. Oh, so it's now exactly half past nine. Look at that.
half nine exactly. Molly is over here. <laughs> she's calming down for the night. She's actually been quite good tonight. She hasn't really barked that much, so I don't work. I don't woken my mother up or anything. Um, but yeah, it's now 9.31. Um, so I'm going to end today's video here and get on with the editing because I think it's going to be a bit of a long one to edit uh, with all the um, photo bit and everything. So uh, I'm going to end today's video here. Uh, don't forget if you like the video give it a thumbs up, leave a comment if you liked any of the photos and you want to know a bit more. Um, don't forget to um, subscribe and click the bell so you always get notified when I upload new videos and I'll see you tomorrow at 6pm. So don't forget, if you dream it, believe it, achieve it. Good night.